laser accessory gives you the ability to add a unique level of detail to your projects. In this video, we will show you how to switch from using your spindle over to your laser accessory for some added detail to a project. After we have completed all of the spindle operations, we will attach the laser head. Be sure to return the spindle back to the original origin position before attaching a laser. With the laser head now attached, we can jog the machine to the correct offset. The offset will vary from machine to machine. If you're not sure what your laser offset should be, be sure to check out our short video on how to find this setting. For this machine, you can see our offset is negative 0.5 for the X and positive 67.1 for the Y. Once you have moved your machine to the correct offset location, press the X, Y, 0 button. This will set up the new origin location for the laser. To set your Z0, lower the laser head down so that it is roughly an eighth of an inch above the material surface. Then press the Z0 button. The next step will be to set the spindle delay to zero. While at the main screen, press the menu button. Select Machine Setup and hit OK. Then Spindle Setup and Spindle Delay. The on delay should read 6000. Press the Run Pause Delete button twice. This will delete that line and allow you to enter in the new value. Input zero, then press the OK button. You can now press the Stop Cancel button until you've returned back to your main screen. Moving on to the laser control board, first insert your key and turn it to the right. The silver toggle switch on top of the board will allow you to switch power between the spindle and the laser. Be sure to switch it to the laser position. Turn the main power switch on, then press the red reset switch. You should see an LED light when activated. At this point, you are ready to select your files to run. Press the Run Pause Delete button on the controller, then select where you would like to run your files from. Highlight your file and select it by pressing the OK button. Adjusting your speed scale before or during an operation will control the speed at which the laser is burning, essentially making it darker or lighter depending on how fast you're running. After all your parameters are set, pressing the OK button one more time will allow the file to begin. To learn more about adjusting the speed scale of your machine, be sure to check out one of our tech tip videos covering speed scale. We hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, for more information, you can always consult your Axiom user manual or simply visit us online at axiomprecision.com.